Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'm Sean Taylor with Silver Creek Realty. I want to bring you to my new listing in Canyon View Estates, entering this beautiful subdivision in uh, Northwest Nampa. We're pulling in off of uh, Canyon View Way, which is only minutes to the freeway. As soon as we pull in, we see this community area straight in front of us, kind of a common area, a little picnic bench over there, and nice place to take the dogs or your kiddos or grandkids, go for a walk. It's a really small community. There's not more than a few streets in the whole thing. And uh, the subject property is down at the end of the street here on the left-hand side, built back in 2014 custom built with a lot of extras included in it. So we're going to pull up over here on the side and uh, show you over here to my left. That's it right there with the American flag, the three car garage, and the huge extended driveway. It's a nice long driveway. You could park a little. Also notice all the windows in the garage. Great for letting a lot of light in. Okay, so we're going to head up to the front of the house here. I love the fascia out here. Looks really pretty. The rock. You've got the small chip bark out here. Lava. Lava chip. Nice flower beds. And like I said, the curbing that's in here and it's stamped. It's really cool. Fully fenced backyard. Rain gutters over the front entry here. Really nice front entry. And you do have a screen door also, electrical outlet. And as we head in, you have a designated entry area. Always like that. Let's see how it's got the architectural style here, which is nice. Nice tall ceilings, nine foot. And then right off to our immediate left, we have the office. Technically, it could be called a bedroom as well, with the vaulted ceilings. Very neutral paint colors. It has the French doors and a closet. Walk in closet there. This vent up here helps with the energy efficiency of the home. Vinyl flooring up here. Coat closet on our left. Nine foot ceilings, like I said, and then as we walk in, we have a huge family room. Room for any size furniture. And windows looking back at the beautiful backyard. And what everyone's looking for right now is nice open kitchen, light and bright. Lots of cabinet space. Drop pennant lighting, recess can lighting. Room for your refrigerator. I like it when the refrigerator, when you're not looking at the side of them. And so it's set back nice and deep. You could put another cabinet up here if you wanted to. These owner, owners opted not to. Huge eating space here. See, this has got room for eight right now, but this could be expanded out about as far as you want. It's got room for the china hutch there. Nice big sliding glass door. And I like that it's not blocking, um, even with this nice size table in here, it's not blocking your way in and out of the house. And we got a partially covered rear patio back here. Again, no rear neighbors, which is fantastic. Here's another look at the kitchen. Stainless steel appliances, Whirlpool. So over here on the left of the house are a couple of the bedrooms and over and off the front we have the office or fourth bedroom and then we've got the master over here. So we'll go ahead and take a quick look since we're already over here. Bedroom number, I guess we'll call this number one. Looks out over the backyard, ceiling fans were added, which is great. Linen closet. and two sinks in here and what's great about this as a kid setup is you've got the door here so someone could be using the potty or showering while the other person's brushing their teeth or what have you 
So there's the shower tub combo here. It's awesome. Vinyl floor, low maintenance, lots of drawers. Really pretty countertops. And the uh, chrome finish on the uh, hardware. Nickel finish on the hardware throughout the house there. Another ceiling fan. Nice wide windows. It's got the double latch on them. Two by six construction. You can see how nice and thick this is. This side of the house on the side, it's got rock, very low maintenance. The owners have the doors. They just like to, they put the dressers inside the closets, maximize efficiency and space and everything. And uh, we'll head over to the front. Okay, we're heading, we're gonna head into the master now. We've got another closet over here. Just closet space everywhere. It's pretty awesome. And uh, I haven't talked about the paint colors much, but we'll get to that in a second. There's a beautiful master bedroom, ceiling fan, and that does come with uh, controls over here on the wall. This is a king size bed and you're swimming in space. You got plenty of space there and over here. They have their TV over here and gun safe and room for pretty much any size furniture here. Private, private rear, rear yard, fully fenced again. So the paint color, it's a nice close up, just a really neutral. It works with grays, it works with brown shades, it works with pretty much anything. Very popular color. And we'll take you into the master bath. It has the his and her sinks. Nice big mirror. Private commode. Toilet area with room for your legs. Sometimes you go in those places and you gotta sit sideways and move the door or this, that, and the other. This one works out pretty nice. Nice deep soaker tub here, again the chrome finish on your faucet. Looking out to the side yard here. And then you also have a nice big shower over here with two bench seats. Put your leg up, shave your legs, sit down, let the water hit you, whatever you want. Nice big bed over here. And then you've got a giant walk-in closet. Room for all your stuff. Even got extra space up there. Pretty cool. And I like the fact they added a window in here for natural light. It's a really overcast day today, so it's kind of dark outside. And yet inside the house, it's still feeling pretty light. All right, now well, I guess we'll take you outside and also to the garage. Okay, we're gonna leave the kitchen area um, because I wanted to show you the garage, but before we get out to the garage, I wanna show you this little mudroom area. You come in, you've got your boots, your gear, your raincoats, your cowgirl hats, whatever you want right here. And off to the left, we have utility room. Washer dryer is still room for additional storage back here, and they had this um, a spot put with a with an outlet for their freezer, which is a great idea. Low maintenance flooring again. We'll take you out to the garage. Show you how spacious this is. Now this is great. Um, the homeowners added the fluorescent lighting added the dual openers because the builder does not include those. He also painted the walls here so it's a nice nice bright white. Has the man door which is what we call it in Idaho, the door over here. And as you can see there's room for pretty much any size vehicle. This is a Denali and you got plenty of space here and in the back you have another three feet too at least. So plenty of space for your cars. So it is a three car garage. There is your controller over here for your automatic sprinkler system. Your furnace, of course, your water heater is set back, which is great. And this is plumbed over here for your water softener. 
and then an outlet right there for that as well. So once you install it, you can plug it in. All right, last step is uh, take a look at the rear, rear yard. Okay, let's head out to one of my favorite parts of this property, which is the rear yard. Again, covered rear patio. Nice and quiet back here. You hear the birds chirping. Got the river rock back here. Got the Oahe mountain range over here. Fire pit area. You have a designated garden space over here in the back. Plenty of room for the kiddos to play as you can see. Fully fenced. It's on an automatic sprinkler system with irrigation water which is very low cost. Here's a look at the back of the house. Room for all the play structures and there's enough space back here to put in a huge shed if you like. I think 10 by 20 is allowed without a permit. A little overgrown right now, but you get the idea. Just an absolutely beautiful home. If you have any further questions about this house, feel free to give me a call. Sean Taylor. I'm a licensed agent with Silver Creek Realty Group. And you can visit me on my website, rockidaho.com, or call me at 208-340-0000. I also respond to texts at that same number. Okay, thank you. Hope you enjoyed the tour.